Oh my gosh, it is 27 degrees and I'm freezing already. <laughs> this is definitely the coldest, coldest weather that I've ever experienced. Can't gets... even talk straight. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was so cute when you saw the snow, but it's almost all melted now. Oh yeah, we had a beautiful snowy morning a couple nights ago <laughs> or a couple mornings ago. Oh, almost at the door. Oh jeez. We're falling apart. Okay, do you want to tell them what our plan is today? Our plan is we're going to hit some Goodwills and then we have one 50% off estate sale day. Yeah, so in this one we have to hit like super fast. So this is a speed run, right? Yeah, speed run okay. and then straight over to the estate sale. Right. Okay, so they just brought out these really cool flamingos right in front of us. And I'm a little bit sad because these are amazing quality. They're from 1996. Who is the signature again? Don Flemingstone or something. Featherstone? <laughs> Featherstone, Featherstone yeah. maybe? Okay, so there's yeah. this little signature. They're actually made by Union Products, and these are definitely the thickest like blow yeah. molds I've ever felt. Those aren't no remakes or anything. No. That's, that's the real deal right there. The only reason I'm bummed is because they're $3 each, and they only sell for like 30 bucks for like a set of two. So yeah. I have to leave them, and that makes me sad. Yeah. But I love them. They're cool. You yeah. want from one for your yard? Uh, no, I better not. Put it I out did there it with the snow? Listen, the last <laughs> one I had, I painted black for Halloween and ruined okay. it. There is one version of those that has, oh, it might be this one actually. Okay. Like the long neck one, but it looked much bigger than this that sold for oh. like $50 for itself. So that's like the oh, set right there. Cool, I didn't even realize. Yeah, so that's like a $30 to $40 set actually. Neat. But, I uh, love them. Yeah, still probably leave those behind. And then he brought out this yeah. guy right here. What is that? Is Listen, that... I thought it was Tanala, but it actually is just signed Mexico. Normally it says Tanala on the bottom. Oh, okay. But it looks like Tanala pottery. That one's cool. It's kind of fantastic. It's got a little, uh, Camel hunchback. Yeah, what kind of is deals? with those? Homes? I don't know. I kind of want to Google image it and see. I think, yeah, I think I would pick that up either way for three ninety nine. Okay, cool. Yeah. So we're just gonna pick it up then. Pick it up. He's All going right. in. Cool little find. Yeah. All right. So we found another item here. I was actually coming to look at these pillow things, but we'll look at those. <laughs> I haven't even looked at them yet. But pillow things. Then I looked up and I saw these little. These cool are so cool. Place mats here. With the grasshoppers. Yeah. So they're made by pomegranate. Okay. And I did a quick little search on them, and these sets are selling for, for like a set of six, they're selling for $50 to $100. Oh, dang. Yeah. They're really nice quality. I think they're just super unique enough that we should probably pick them up. I think so too. Those grasshoppers are amazing. Yeah. What are the placemats here? They're like 59 cents Very a piece cheap, or something? Yeah, 59 yeah. cents. Yeah. So, and how many are there? There's like I don't know. I definitely more than six. I was hoping one might be a table runner or something okay. up in there, but it I might think be. I think there's one big one that's like folded right here. One, two, three. Or is that just a placement too? I think it's two together. Okay. So four, five, six, seven. Is that more than eight? I don't know. That's crazy. That's four. If it is. Oh, it is eight. Eight. Nice. Okay. That's awesome. So that's. So you can do two sets of four. Oh yeah. Or just one big old set. Oh, that's pretty too. Isn't that pretty? I've never seen lace little houses. Yeah. Okay, and we have, we literally have seven minutes until we have to seven leave. Seven minutes? Yeah. Okay. Let me pull this down. Okay, thank you. Okay, it's not working. All right, there we go. <laughs> what the heck is that? That was a table runner. I think it's a balance. Oh, a balance. I was just trying to see who it was made by. There's no maker on here, though. No maker? Okay. No. Okay. Pretty that's little cottage go. balance there. Isn't it pretty? Okay, so we'll grab fun. the grasshoppers yep. and I'm going to start looking into these. Okay. And we got seven minutes, so seven we'll split minutes. up for a second. Yep. All right, cool. All right, Matt's over there still digging through the place with <laughs> And I just looked up, so these are two cute little Linux decorations. Unfortunately, they're the baby's first Christmas ones, which are never that great. Uh, these two both sell for about $15 to $17 each, and they're priced at $3.99. So we're gonna leave those behind. Okay, how cool are these little guys though? Look at the paint job on Santee. I wish you guys could feel how heavy this is. This is like multiple pounds. Looks like it says Made in China carved on the bottom for $4.99. It's a set of two though. Oh man, these are cool. This has to be at least four pounds. Little reindeer. Hmm. I don't like that they're $4.99 each, but if I had to guess, these would be worth like 40 bucks. I don't know. Let's ask Matt what he thinks about these guys. Okay. What do you, you think about there? these guys? They're heavier oh, than they look. Yeah, they definitely are heavier. Is that like a stocking holder or something? Yeah, but okay. the only downside is that they're four ninety nine each. Four ninety nine. Okay. But I'm digging the paint job, especially on Santa. Yeah, that hand painting is everything right there. Is Santa okay. cooler than Rudolph, or am I just? I think so. I think there's more detail in his face and everything. But for it's sure. a set. So what do we do here? I think that uh, you could either sell them as a set or separately, right? Oh no, but they're five bucks each. Well, I would what, think like 40 bucks for the set. 40 for the set, I yeah. Know. I think that's a good idea. Anything hand painted and like custom made that kind of looks cool, 
people are going to appreciate and and that's I what I appreciate yeah. and I like to buy so it's yeah cool so get everything it's cool that they're marked like yeah carved in yeah that's what I was thinking a little yeah all right so we're gonna get them. I, I think we should grab them. All right. Let's yeah, see. let's grab them. Okay. And we have three minutes left. Oh, and those pillowcases were nothing. So I know I was gonna tell an update. Oh. They're nothing. Oh, the, okay. Yeah, the ones I was originally talking about. Okay. Gotcha. No bueno. Okay, so Amanda's gonna check the T-shirt section, and I'm gonna go up here and check the specialty purse rack. But fair warning, this section has been kind of highly priced lately. Like their Veras are all at like 24 bucks. Let's see how much this one is because it's new with tags. $17.99. Okay, that's not bad if that were personal, even though it's just one of those little thin nylon bags. Okay, that's what I'm used to seeing. $25.99 for Vera Bradley. Tons of Vera Bradley up here. And honestly, you have to find a really good pattern or a sought after pattern for Vera Bradley to do well. That or like a newer style. Oh, give me something fake. What is that? $25.99. I have no idea what brand that is, but it's cute. It doesn't feel very great though. Hmm. What the heck is that thing? Sunny life. Oh, like a sun pop-up thingy? Sun tent thingy? Okay. No purses for us. Darn it. We have one minute left on the counter. Okay, so that's gonna be it for us, babe, in here? Yeah, I think we're out of time. Yeah, we have to head and get our ticket. Go get that uh, number one and two, hopefully, right? Yeah, right. Yeah. We would have to be in line for like an hour to get one and two. <clears throat> There's definitely people in line right now. Oh, oh, for sure. Yeah. Thankfully, it's 20 degrees, so that'll keep some people away. These cans are really clean, and there's no sticker on them, though. Do you think this is the a sticker that, that was supposed to be on it? The fact that there's one says it's a specialty. Oh, okay. I think that's what they do now. If they're if specialty, they're... they leave them out here with the regular shoes, but okay. they just put one. Should we ask them? Because... You want to? That is really nice. Oh, yeah. We'll just ask them when we get up there, and then uh, okay. we'll go from there. All right, we gotta go. Yeah, we do gotta go. We let's have go. to get in line. Let's go. Let's okay, go. let's go see. Okay, so we just checked out, but before we walk out the door, I just want to show you guys these cuties. We actually looked these up the other day when we were in here. And how much How much were they worth? 20 bucks for the pair? 20 for the set, yeah. And these are new with tags and they're made by Dakin. But how cute are these little raggedy Ann and Andy dressed like? Are they cowboys or Toy Story? <laughs> I don't know. It could be either or. It looks like Woody. <laughs> okay, Very let's cool. go. Sorry, All I right, forget so, where. Yeah, yeah, we're on a time crunch, but it's okay because we just want to. We don't want to stand outside in this 20 degree weather. No. We just want to grab a ticket and run, right? That's right. <clears throat> okay. Uh, total was 20 bucks. That's pretty good. So those uh, table, what are they called? Placemats? Uh-huh. They're like super cheap. Yeah. Like I can't believe that. And that's... I think these will sell like very fast oh, too. Oh, very fast. They're, they yeah. have grasshoppers on them. Come yeah. on, that's so unique. What cool family is not going to want those, right? I would definitely want those. My kid's bug obsessed. Yeah. All right, you're driving because yep. it's a uh, risk of ice. <laughs> risk of ice, that's yeah. right. Yeah, I'm not messing with this nice car. Oh, that's smart. <laughs> You've no, you're not used to it. Yeah, not All used right, to it. Let's All right, go. let's do it. All right, guys, so we've pulled up to get our ticket. You all see that little thing? They put that out an hour before the sale opens. Yeah, this is nice. So we just missed the line. We're like three minutes late. So all of these cars that are lined up down the streets are the people that were here waiting for the ticket. So we're not going to be in first, but... At least we have a number. All right, J49. Okay. And J50. I wonder if we're actually 49th and 50th. Doubt Sometimes it. they don't start it over because they don't yeah. want to waste their tickets. Yeah, I doubt they do. But uh, judging by how many cars are on the street and the trailers, like people are going to come. Oh. They're coming here to buy it today. Oh, for sure. And they have their list of, of stuff that was too expensive yesterday. Buyers. There's this guy, these people in this trailer right here, they're all staring at us. I can tell there's like four of them in there. Like, what the heck oh, yeah, are right they there. doing? <laughs> Okay, all right. We'll be back in an hour, right? No, yeah, we're heading to another thrift store and then we'll be back. Okay, so we have not been to this Goodwill. Well, we've only been here once, right? We've been here once and we weren't even really making a video that day. I had to pee. Fair, fair <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we're out trinket shopping We that were day. trinket shopping and we came here to use their bathroom. Yeah. But, so what is this? Lee's Town Goodwill. It's kind Leastown, of far away yeah. from home, but close to the state cell. So. Yeah, How only seven get? minutes from. Yeah. I don't know. Are they even open? Where is the door? What the heck? Oh, oh, right here probably. Okay. <laughs> We're used to those automatic doors. <laughs> oh, yeah, well, this thank you. a little older. I was hoping that this little cutie had something in the box, but unfortunately it's just the empty box up here for sale. Maybe we'll find the little angel somewhere out. But isn't she cute? I'm not familiar with Timco. Have you ever heard of Timco made in Japan? Timco? No. This little angel that is not in the box. I'm, I heard you say that, yeah. so I'm looking for an angel now. <laughs> yeah, keep your eyes peeled. <laughs> yeah, we'll find it hopefully. Oh. Uh, Oh man, I wish they had more than one of these. 
Keep your eyes peeled for these little serverler canisters. Oh, too. is it a little Tupperware? A little Tupperware. I've never seen the navy one like that. I uh, know, it's in really good shape too. Yeah, that's little cool. Little flowers. Well, there's some scratches, but it looks pretty good. I wish there was not I've been hoping. <laughs> How cute are these little, well, is that Humpty Dumpty, you think? Little Humpty Dumpty guy? <laughs> oh yeah. I don't know if it's East, like it's with the Easter stuff, oh, but. Yeah. So I don't know if it's just a cutie little wood egg kind or if it's a Humpty rabbit. Wait, pull that string and see if it makes his legs move. Okay, let's see. Oh, there yeah, you does. go. <laughs> and his arms, that's cool. Show me, show them, show okay, us. Okay, let's see. Boom. <laughs> oh man, his legs stuck. <laughs> Why are those so cute? Those are cute. Okay, I'm gonna leave these because they're $2 each, but those are seriously super cute. Yeah, little cuties. Oh, that's, that's a nice. a cute little jar. Ooh, hand carved and etched and painted. Yeah. Let's see how much it is. Nine nine cents. That's reasonable. That is reasonable. I like that. You like, that's, you that's like a good it? little fun right there. Yeah. Good thing you saw those Humpty Dumpties. <laughs> Still not convinced <laughs> that they're Humpty Dumpties, but yeah. cute nonetheless. Close enough. All right, let's keep digging. All right, cool. Oh, you guys, I'm a little bummed up about this one. Look at this cool tapestry pillow with these cool wood beads on the bottom. Look at that. Is that a peacock? And we got a monkey with a little parasol, but all those beads aren't there missing. Oh. Look how pretty that pillow is. That's very nice. A little, was that tapestry? Or? Yes, and look, it's got the little, is that a cheetah? It's got cheetahs, it's so, got uh, peacocks, yeah, dragonflies, dragonflies, monkeys. But look, it's this part is all oh, off, and I'm lost really all sad beads. about it, because that is, this might be my favorite pillow that I've ever, yeah, that we've come across. That would have been really cool. It is. In a house somewhere. Oh, back it goes. Uh, I picked up this because I know Kinsley has one of these, right? Yeah, she does. And you paid a lot of money for it, so <laughs> I, I don't know if you wanted to look into it. Is this it standard and... price Vera Bradley? Yeah. Oh my gosh, Vera... catch me, I'm fake. Oh, gee, what are you doing? oh, that was... <laughs> that was fake, honey. That was fake. <laughs> I was worried for a second. Okay. And Did it looks clean, see? too. No, he tried to catch my fake paint. I was painting because it was reasonably priced. Yeah. Normally their beer is like ridiculous. Five something, right? Okay, that's probably worth it for a backpack. Okay, should we look into it and see what this uh, model's going I for? I mean, no. this is in really nice condition and it's a very pretty pattern. Yeah. I mean, how yeah, much, we can look into how it. How much are those retail? Retail? I know you've told me before and I was like shocked how much you paid um, for a like, kid's backpack, but. Okay, you're just like outing me all the no, pieces it's good. right now. It's, there are Kinsley like a hundred-ish dollars retail. 150, almost that, two. She got the matching lunch box, okay. hush. Okay. All oh right, my well, gosh. What? What's wrong? I'm going to get rested. <laughs> no, you're not. Mind your business, y'all. <laughs> it's a backpack that she'll use for years to come, right? And she's had cheap backpacks for forever. It yeah. was her one nice backpack. There's nothing wrong with buying yeah. your kid a nice backpack. And it's her travel backpack, too. Yeah. Very cool. So we'll look into that real quick? Yeah, we're going to look into it. All right, cool. Okay, so Matt's looking into the Vera backpack, and I was just looking into this little 31 Paisley lunchbox. I was hoping it was going to be a little bit better, but it only sells for 15 bucks. That's no good. Well, if it was like 99 cents, but they have a sticker inside that said 5.99. Oh, okay. So we're going to be passing on that. Passing on that one? Yeah. Okay. Uh, this backpack, like I, I found one that sold in the same color for okay. 35. Okay. But like there's other one that goes up to like 150 for these backpacks. Right. It just depends on the pattern. That's what I was yeah. explaining in the last video, guys, is that it really just depends so much on the pattern. But considering it's a backpack at yeah. five bucks, I would think most backpacks are worth it for five dollars. Oh, for sure. I was so, trying to find some other ones to yeah. show now, you guys. Now, like if this was Kinsley's like sea turtle pattern that she has, it would be like 75 okay. bucks used. So I'm, so I'm guessing that the Paisley ones like this are just like their standard line. Yeah. And so many for yeah. years they've been redoing the Paisley and different. Yeah. But they're, they're I mean, some of them sell good too. The, yeah. Like these aren't actually that. These are the newer ones too that I was mentioning in the last. Yeah. You weren't with me, but I was kind of giving them a little Vera Bradley update in the last one. This is an older style, but it will okay. still sell. Yeah. Yeah. Even for 35 bucks, yeah. it's going to sell fast. Too. Yeah. Right. So. $5.99. Okay. The other Goodwill had them priced a minimum of 20 bucks. So this yeah. is a good, a good find. Yeah. Just remember, I put our other thing in there. Okay. When we go to check out, I don't want to accidentally steal it. Okay. Sounds good. I'm going to go that way because our countdown is counting. Okay. And I'm going to go count down over there. Okay. See ya. All right. So I just found this little set here. So this one's called Kemlor Mills and it's a pillow and sheet set. And the reason I looked it up is because it's like a, a hunting set. The coolest part to me is these little bass guys, the largemouth bass. I did look these up and just a set of pillows. It was like two pillows sold for $30. And uh, this one coming with the sheet as well, you know, I think we could at least get maybe 45, 50 for this set maybe. Those are cool. I'm hoping, yeah. You wanna see what I found? Uh, yeah, what do you got there? Listen. 
This is a Ralph Lauren duvet. Ralph Lauren? Oh, geez, that thing's big. This? The back side has these cool little stripes on it. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. I'm not sure what size this is. What's, what does this look like? It's definitely uh, it looks not, huge. I think it might be a king. I think it might be a king, yeah. That's, okay, but that's bigger than a queen. Are you ready for this? Okay, yeah, I'm ready. I found a sold comp for a twin slash queen for $299. For, in used condition? In used. No way. Okay. That thing is nice. I'm so excited. It's been so long <laughs> since I found like a really good Ralph Lauren piece. I'm surprised you were able to keep that excitement in. Well, I, I had not even... Squeal, <laughs> <laughs> I heard you recording, so I was trying to keep it in. Oh, okay. So I didn't even get to the tag on the inside yet. If you guys don't know, the Ralph Lauren buttons actually say like Lauren okay. on them. So where wow. is the tag? I don't even know if it has one. I don't know. It's got to be in cut. there somewhere, hopefully. I'm just glad the buttons say and yeah. I found it really quickly. There's That's none. So awesome. I don't think there was any listed. So you said the twin queen sold for two something? Two ninety nine on a bid. That was one bid. Two ninety nine for one okay. bid. So I think theirs had two pillowcases with it, and ours okay. has no pillowcases. So we're looking at at least two ninety nine. If this is the king, it's probably closer to five hundred dollars. No way. I mean, I've sold just Ralph Lauren sheets for almost five hundred dollars okay. before. So that's crazy. <laughs> I'm so excited. Man. Yours are really cool too, though. Uh, not compared to yours, though. Well, we're not comparing. Okay. We're getting both. <laughs> those are really cool, though. Yeah. Those are other. Oh, my phone. I like the, the little bass on those. Oh, nice. wait. Look how cool that is. That is cool. Yeah. That's very cool. I was going to say I had it up on my phone still. Oh, okay. Let's check it out. So, so, wait a second. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Oh, this one right here. Oh, this one is new. So okay. New without tags. Okay. I need to keep looking. Questionable new without Questionable. tags. Well, so yeah. Could be Because it's open. Yeah. Either way. Either These way. These are it's, what? $5 for the big ones? Yeah. It's going to be multi-hundred dollars for that one oh, yeah. duvet. Oh, yeah. Okay. And well, it's 11.42, so we have to be back to that estate. So. Yeah, we got to start checking out in like two, three minutes. Yep. Okay, yep. let's go look around a little bit more okay. and then uh, get to that estate sale. Okay, keep your eyes out for anything that matches this. Oh, I my God. Oh, geez. Hopefully we can find a pillow, matching pillow over here or something. And for the record, before you guys tell me to look, I actually did just go through those pillowcases looking for these and they weren't oh, there. okay. You scoured through them. <laughs> Somebody will tell us, why didn't you go look? <laughs> <laughs> we did, I promise. <laughs> so it looks like this cute little Eddie Bauer kids tractor sheet set. They have a price at $7.99 and it sells for 40 bucks. So we're gonna snag that too. I'm also really curious, you guys see that? Are those irises made by Canon? I think it's new with because I can see the little hooky on there. But I'm curious how much that is too. What Isn't that so at? pretty? This little vintage towel with the can with that little iris on it. Oh yeah. But it doesn't have a price. It's kind of throwing me off that it's crazy. Back it's there behind special. the case. The yeah. case. But we want to snag those right okay. there. They sell for like forty bucks. Do you mind if we uh, get one item in, out of here? We're gonna probably get one of these items here, if you don't mind, sir. Awesome. Thank you. Uh, the little sheet set right there with the tractors on it. Oh, then uh, we also want to check the price on that towel also in that green basket. Right here? The little towel, yeah, yeah, thank you. Thanks, sir. Looks like an older one. Yeah. It is kind of old, but I don't see a price on it. Oh, okay. Is it, so do you is guys that have a standard? For them, it's iron. Okay. okay, got a little stain. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, it does okay. have a little stain. Okay, I'll pass on that since it has a little stain, but we'll take those. Okay. All right, you got something else for us? Yeah, you, oh, say, you just say something about a steeple clock? I was just looking at that pretty <laughs> clock. It's a steeple clock. Yeah, it's I've shaped never, like steeply. Never heard of a steeple. A steeple? Oh, because I said steeple? Look at that. What is that? I don't know what it is, but it's really cool. It's very cool. Yeah. But is it the lid of the rest of a birdie bird? I don't know. I just thought you put it right on the shelf and it's like something's coming out of the the ground oh, or your shelf, that you know? That's cool. I don't know how much he is yet. He's $1.99. Oh, okay. You might be right. He might just be like a creepy little. I think he's just a creepy thing. Cause creepy cool little dude. Like usually if it's going to be a top, I guess that is hollow there. But, but it doesn't have that little lip. Yeah, that there's usually lip. like a lip that prevents it from sliding yeah. off so i think I you're right know. but i like it we should get him yeah he's just like kind of interesting creepy anytime we find anything yeah. that's even slightly creepy our people always yeah. uh, snatch those up too the dude that's rolling this around said i could look through it so okay, i don't cool. know if you want to just like take a quick peek and then we go check out your steeple clock well we're passing afterwards. on the steeple clock because it's 75 bucks but it's beautiful and i want to oh, show okay, the people cool. made in england just gorgeous all right okay okay i don't see anything in there all right well at least we got this little cool guy right yes all right let's go you look good with that Look at, you're covered in paisley. You I got know. paisley on the front and paisley on the back. We, sh we should have grabbed a back or a, a cart. <laughs> All right. Styling. Okay, so while he goes to get in line, I just want to show you guys this beautiful clock. Look at this. It has like the extra little things on the side with the nice floral pattern. 
What's that say? New England. Bristol. Bristol, New England. I just think that's gorgeous. I found a salt comp for one without these extra little peaks that sold for $125. So this one could be better, but it's $75. So I'm going to stop there. Oh, it even has a little wind up thing. Isn't that beautiful? All right, I'm going to go join that guy in line. Okay, so while he's still standing in line, I was looking at this little Pandora Santa ornament. I didn't even know they made ornaments, but it looks like he's priced at $4.99 and he sells for about $35. I don't know if ours is actually new in the box or used and put back in the box, but I'm gonna ask to see him. Okay, so we just checked out and the little Santa Linux was not new and he had a little chippy. So we're gonna leave him behind. I have an issue, he's getting this on my back. <laughs> it's okay, you look cute with your back full of loot. Yeah. <laughs> Before we fully walk out, just look at this real quick. Oh, cause... yeah. Okay, I, I thought this was one of those vintage things. Oh, but, okay. okay. I thought you were going to show them the, the mural down there. Oh, uh, the mural? Yeah. Okay, yeah. I don't know who that is, though. That's that little pizza spot we went pee at one time. Oh, uh, no, we went pee there, <laughs> but who is that guy? Oh, I don't know. I wish I did, but I don't. There's some really I pretty murals know. around here that we need to show them at some point. Tom. Oh yeah, there's that bass one over in uh, downtown Nicholasville oh, on Main yeah. Street. That thing's super cool. That's my favorite one out of all of them. No, my favorite one is the one that looks like Keeneland with all the horse racing. Oh, that'd be cool too. You can barely tell it's uh, it's not real. Yeah, so the total here was $28. Uh -huh. We rounded up and uh, yeah, just your Ralph Lauren thing alone is going to be Oh my gosh. Man, that's going to be like a 10X just on that. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty excited. Oh, yeah. Now we're going to run over and go to this estate sale and see if we can find anything yeah. half off. One, one more thing. Okay. The duvet was only $5.99. Oh yeah, isn't that so amazing? That, that's crazy. <laughs> All right, let's go to that estate sale. Okay, let's go. Okay, so we are back at home. Um, I almost said unfortunately, not unfortunately, but that estate sale ended up being way more amazing than we thought. So we did not have, not have time to put it in this video. So now we are going to pull some orders and you guys will have to check the next video for the estate sale. Slightly sorry about that, but not because it was fabulous. It was a good one. It was a good one. Yeah, definitely check back for that. Yeah, so we have 17 orders going out for just under $700. Okay, I'm glad you're here because the first one is up high and it's I don't have high? to get my stool. Yeah, the okay. mushroom pitcher. Mushroom pitcher. Mushroom okay. pitcher. I think up it's high. made by oh. Libby. Yeah, I that see it one. Right here. That's okay. the one. That's a cool little pitcher. It is cool. It took a few months to sell. I think I paid $3 for this and it only sold for $20, but. Oh, okay. I couldn't leave it behind because it's so precious yeah, with the mushrooms. Yeah, you had to save it. Had to save it. Give okay, it. next up, this little Tanala figure. <laughs> we did not know what to call this when we found it, but I think I just listed it as a little, I think I literally just said winged figure, actually. Yeah, it's got a little hole in the top, so you could throw <laughs> some candles or incense in there, maybe. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, multi-purpose. There you go. She sold for $15. There we go. All right, up next, we have some sandals that sold. Let's see if I could find them. Okay, I think it's these ones right here. So these are some coach sandals, and I guess they're the Ulyssa or Ulyssa model. And I remember we got these, it was at a garage sale, right? Yeah. Okay, we paid a dollar for them, and they sold for 20 bucks. Took about maybe two months, three months? Yeah, that's about right. Not too bad. No. Next up, we have another Tanala figure, this pretty Ooh. little owl. I don't know, is that giving it justice? Because this has like a glossy gray color that yeah. I've never seen in a Tanala. They can kind of see, ooh, the back's Isn't even that so cute? Yeah. $15. And this is one of many owls that we have going out today. Okay, nice. <laughs> All right, next up we have this awesome Le, ooh, Le Sport Sack. This one's actually a duffel bag. And I think I only paid a dollar for this and it sold for 50 bucks. And I only found out about this like the day before from you. Oh, the Le Sport Sack? Yeah. yeah. Had no idea it was a goodie. Yeah, they're definitely uh, an item to look out for. Yep. 50 bucks. 50 buckaroonies. All right, what do you got next? Uh, so we got the rest of the owls that sold today, okay. I think. Uh, I think it's this little gripping right here, right? Oh, yeah. So we got the incense candle holder, right? And Yeah, I think so. I mean, you could put like oil. I think maybe one of those little triangle incense oh, thingies okay. goes in there. Multi purpose. Yeah, and then we got the little wood carved owl. Yeah, a little, little cool looking dude. With the glass He's eyes. He's got some character yep. there. And a little trinky dish. Not bad. Good little lot. I think that sold for $59, right? All right. Yeah, that's right. Not bad. Okay, D3. Right. D3 as yep. in this one right here? Yep, as in that okay. one. Okay. What are we pulling We're out We're pulling out a Briar Horse. His Ooh. name is Sham, King of the okay. Wind. Is He's it an December 3 or D3? D3. Okay, that's oh, no. December 3. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I've been okay. going through stuff while you've been gone. Oh, we're good. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so let's see if he's in here. He's got to be, right? right? Yeah. Okay, he's probably protected in here. 
Not a brown one, right? No, he's a black stallion. Okay. All right, there's him, and we'll show him real quick. Yeah, I gotta whip him out. What'd this guy sell for? Oh man, already. Hang on, let me. Let's see. Twenty-five dollars. Twenty-five buckaroonies. Oh wow. Okay. Isn't he a pretty guy? Yeah, he's a nice guy right there. <laughs> we got him at a garage sale, right? At a garage sale. Yeah, super cheap. Yep. All right, we have uh, some clothing. Oh, it would be deep. It's a hard one with one hand, but I can do it. Oh, you did it. So this has only been listed for about a week. You picked yeah. this at Goodwill. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And it's just a really nice Peter Millar shirt with little, did I say shirt? Shirt. It's a nice little shirt. It's little got shirt. Martinis all over it, little drinks and stuff. That's right. That was a cool little find. It was. That's uh, I'm glad that it sold fast. And yeah. It sold for what we said it was going to sell for. That's right. Yeah. By the way, I just want to say really quick, you guys have been asking me about these little cellophane bags and where I get them. I pick them up on Amazon and I'm going to put the link. Actually, I think I'll just pin it in the top comment below. I've probably gotten a hundred, if not more people yeah. asking where we get these bags. Lots of people asking. They're lifesavers. All right, up next we got a video game going out. These things, man, we're, we don't have much left of these, huh? No, they sell fast. They sell fast. That one sold in two days, the one you're going to Two days on. right here? Okay, yeah. so this is a Sonic Forces for the Switch. It is brand new sealed. I think we paid a dollar for it and it sold for $18.99. Yep. Nice quick flip. Yes, sir. Okay, I've got some Crabtree and Evelyn Body Mist. Is that the right Ooh, one? Yes, yeah, okay. Summer Hill. Summer Hill. This was in a lot full of stuff, so we probably paid like pennies for this. Yeah, 10 not cents, much 50 of, cents, yeah. I don't know. Super cheap. And it's over $29 for shipping. Okay, cool. Yep. All right, going F4? Yep. All right, Eve's Rocher. Which one? There's so many it's of them. It's F4. They're nice and oh, large. Okay. Look at that oh, labeling there system. You go. Oh, okay. that's the last one. Those sold so fast. Nice. Okay, so this cream. I think like a bunch of these creams. So it was all these mm -hmm. with a ton more $20 we paid. So yeah, it was a crazy yeah. score. What this one sell for? $18. 18 bucks. And that's one, that's the last of four. Last of four. Okay. Yeah. So this is the, the one you want to find yeah. then. Okay. Okay. So last, this is the last piece of that awesome um, wildflower corral set that we yeah. picked up at that yard sale. Mm -hmm. This only sold for $20. 20 bucks. But those glasses, the matching glass tumblers. Oh, those were nice. Uh, they sold for over a hundred dollars Yeah. in each lot. We had two lots. So keep an eye out for the tumblers <laughs> of those. <laughs> I think we paid 15 for everything. Right? Yeah. For the whole box. Okay, and cool. we had multiple sets of plates. Yeah. This is seriously the very last piece. Not bad. We That's made a, a lot of money off that. desirable pattern there. Yeah. It's beautiful. Awesome. All right, next up, this one sold within like an hour or two. Yeah, this was in this video too. Yes, and how much were they, $6.99? Yeah, we paid $6.99 mm -hmm. and they sold for? $49.99. Yeah. Yeah, they sell for a little bit more than that, but there was a lot listed, so I went slightly under. Yeah, we got lucky. We didn't even check the box before we bought it, <laughs> but uh, it was a little bit of a challenge counting these things because yeah. the box opens weird, but it they does. were all in there. It was complete. <laughs> it took me longer to open the box. This is embarrassing, but it seriously <laughs> took me longer to figure out how to open it than it did to count them up. And to list it, probably. Yeah. Well, no, the listing wasn't that bad. <laughs> okay. Okay, February 2. <laughs> February 2. Oh, this what little cutie. A little oh, Hawaiian, Hawaiian doll. Girl, yeah. And we just picked her up in California a yeah. couple weeks ago. Do we have any more of those postcards left? Oh, we do. Okay. We, we actually so. ordered more because we felt so bad to not send everybody postcards. So we bought a whole new box yeah. of them. So special be a from special Kelly. Special postcard in that one. There you go. And this one sold for $14. Okay, cool. Yeah. Okay, this next one we might have picked up in this video, but yeah. <laughs> we've been getting a lot of uh, wedges, so. Yeah, and yeah, we make lots of videos. So these right ones, yes, these born sandals we picked up at Goodwill for $5.99 and they mm -hmm. sold for $27 in one day. That's not bad. Okay. No. So I got one better here. So okay. we sold a calculator too, right? Or yes. I don't even know it's better. It's, I don't even know how much okay. this thing sold for. It's easier to ship. So we'll go better. Yeah. For sure. Easier to ship. But I think it sold for $29. It so did. about the same. Two dollars more. Two dollars so more. Counts okay. Better. Yeah. All right. I thought and it was a forty-nine dollar calculator. Yeah. And this one has no cords or anything. It's just the calculator itself. And I picked these up, two of them up for five dollars. And I think this is the last one. Yeah. Is that like a graphing calculator? Yeah. And but it also is like a school property edition, so they don't quite sell for as much. But oh, okay. yeah. Oh, and it's missing the case. All right. Well, yeah. still sold. All right. Next up, we have these two vintage Libby glasses with the cutesy little duckies on there. And they sold for $20 plus shipping. Not bad. I think we only paid a dollar each for those. Yeah. At the same time, we bought these little beauties. Oh, yeah. That set's going to be good, too. Yeah. It's it all is. done. Well, that's all the items that we sold today, right? Yeah. That's it. But we're going to hit that music now so you guys can see the comps on yeah. everything we just picked up. That's going to be good. And then we brought out this yeah. guy right here. What is that? Is Listen, I thought it was Tanal. It's a nice 
saw these little these little are so cool. place mats here. With the grasshoppers? Yeah. How does it they're $4.99 each? $4.99, okay. But I'm digging the paint job, especially on Santa. Yeah. That's a nice. little jar. Oh, and car. Mm -hmm. okay. Is this standard price here, Bradley? Yeah. Oh my gosh, sure. touch me, I'm painting. Oh, The reason I looked it up is because it's like a, a hunting set. It's uh, definitely it looks not, huge. I think it might be a king. I think it might be a king, yeah. That's, okay, but. Cute little Eddie Bauer kids tractor sheet set. They have a price of seven. Yeah. But is it the lid of the rest of a birdie bird? I don't know. I just. 